Merci. Bien. Ah, Mr. Bergerot, two games to lose. What's uh, what's the matter? What's it? In the, a goal in the first few few minutes, beginning to the, the match, and after. What's happening? I think that we had um, started the match ouais. very well. Great. I think the match started out very well. We knew that the Colombia team was a good team. Quand on tombe sur une équipe enthousiaste, comme elle a été, qu'on prend un but, après, je crois que l'équipe a pris un petit coup au moral. On a essayé de revenir, de trouver des solutions en deuxième mi-temps. On a eu beaucoup d'occasions. On est tombé sur une super gardienne, mais bon, après, c'est vrai qu'on a, a manqué de, 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 justesse, de justesse technique euh, par rapport à certaines, à certaines situations. Et puis, c'est vrai que... À la fin du match, euh, on a tenté le, le tout pour le, le tout. Pour le tout. Donc, bon, on a pris un, un deuxième but, mais euh, je pense que celui qui nous a tués, c'est vraiment le second goal. Philippe, beaucoup d'envois, vous Philippe, décidez de faire jouer Elise et, et Elodie. Euh, pourquoi ces choix au, au fait que je, je voulais amener un petit peu de, je voulais amener un petit peu de fraîcheur. Ah, ça marchait, ça marchait d'entrée. Et, et après, c'est vrai que, que l'équipe a un petit peu, un petit peu sombré. De faire tourner, de faire tourner l'effectif. Je pense que. Pour moi, c'est le collectif qui a perdu le match aujourd'hui. Le groupe a perdu le match aujourd'hui. Ce n'est pas un joueur ou un autre. On a eu énormément de, énormément d'occasions. Nous avons eu beaucoup d'opportunités, en fait. Honnêtement, on peut s'en prendre qu'à nous-mêmes. Les seules personnes à blâmer sont nous-mêmes. Question, s'il vous plaît. Oui, Philippe, vous avez parlé de la Déception, parce que What's your feeling? je pense que ce qui est, ce qui est important, c'est prendre les matchs, par, was to les matchs par match. Take et, it. Game by game, si and to know that even if we had a great game against England, there it's true that we had some issues in all areas. But we had some issues in all areas. 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 We had some issues En seconde période, il y a une main de Mexicaine. Est-ce que vous considérez que l'arbitrage était défavorable ce soir Je ne veux pas dire défavorable, mais sur ce coup-là, s'il y a un carton jaune, il y a un carton rouge aussi, il y a une expulsion. Donc après, c'est 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 une expulsion. Je ne dirais pas que c'est une, une, une fois qui fait basculer le, 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 le match, mais c'est vrai que ça, 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 ça joue dans le, dans, le, dans le résultat. However, it mais must bon, be taken into account euh, when you look at the results. Plus s'attarder sur, euh, sur, sur le fait que voilà, on a été, on a été vraiment secoué par cette équipe, de, 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 de cet enthousiasme de l'équipe de, de Colombie. Colombie. C'est vrai, je pense qu'il y a une faute d'arbitrage. It's true, but I think there were some there were some issues with the officiating. Euh, vous dites avoir sombré collectivement, c'est quoi C'est la physique qui a manqué, c'est la fraîcheur, qu'est-ce qui, qu qui a posé pour les mentions Non, je crois que c'est euh, l'équipe a baissé de pied un petit peu après le but. Non, je pense qu'ils se sont retournés après le premier but, l'équipe a fait. C'est vrai que ça, ça, a été, ça a été compliqué pendant 10 minutes. Et puis, euh, je pense qu'on n'a peut-être pas assez joué aussi en bloc. Je pense qu'on n'a peut-être pas assez joué aussi en bloc. L'équipe était assez, assez, assez tirée. The team was spread out, and from then on, I think that we put ourselves in this difficulty. Next question. 
Oui, Philippe, après l'Angleterre, beaucoup de filles ont parlé de stress, de nervosité, et puis ont dit ça ira beaucoup mieux au deuxième match. Et là, vous dites qu'elles ont été prises par l'enthousiasme des Colombiennes. Et puis, qu'est-ce qui se passe pour vous expliquer qu'ils ont été tardées à rentrer dans ce mondial par rapport à leur retard au premier match Oui, c'est vrai que... On a été, the on a été game, terriblement gêné par, uh, yes, par l'impact de ces, de we ces, de ces joueuses. Uh, si, uh, si on prend the le pourcentage players, de, 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 de duels, je crois qu'il uh, uh, doit être one favorable on one terriblement en, plays. En, cette équipe, en cette équipe colombienne. Donc on the a pêché Columbia aussi dans les, dans, les, dans, les, dans les duels et quand on, quand on perd les duels, uh, c'est vrai qu'on perd, perd, on perd on les, on les matchs. And when you when that happens, you often lose the game. I'd like to know your next game is against Mexico. How are you going to bring back your team and give them the little extra kick that they need? So that Mais, you euh, je pense que déjà, end up coming out of the pool. On va, on va analyser le match. Well, we're certainly going to analyze this game. Un petit peu l'état physique de, 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 the, des joueuses. Uh, physical uh, situation uh, of our players. Uh, and if necessary, we have faire the faire next game in un petit peu de, days, un petit peu de fraîcheur. And we'll bring some, some new freshness into the squad. Philippe, vous allez jouer votre qualification Philippe, sur you un dernier match avec la pression de ça. Ça peut engendrer. Est-ce qu'il y a des inquiétudes à avoir Il y a des inquiétudes. Il y a des inquiétudes. Je ne pense pas, étant donné que c'est un groupe qui, euh, qui, qui, qui a envie de, qui a envie de réussir. Euh, je pense qu'il va falloir un petit peu se reposer dans les, se reposer dans les têtes et puis euh, voilà, rebondir sur ce, sur, sur, sur ce match. Et puis, on va se reposer dans les têtes et puis on va se reposer une, une qualification pour, pour nous, mais c'est vrai que We may get voilà, on, into on, the doit, qualifying on doit une, une revanche euh, par Even rapport if, à ce match. Même si c'est un match égal, nous devons regarder ça. La dernière question, s'il vous plaît. Après le but, on a senti les After filles goal, vraiment, vraiment the, uh, on a senti beaucoup de nervosité dans leur really jeu avant le mondial, donc ça se trouve dans le cette compétition. Est-ce qu'aujourd'hui, elles ont été défaillantes so today, non, je pense pas. Je ne parlerai pas de, 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 de défaillance, mais euh, 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 on avait connu cette situation contre le, contre le Japon. Ah, on su, on when we played Japan, puis là, and we came back from that. Sur ce match-là, euh, ben, on n'a pas su euh, that game, euh, se remettre dans les, dans les situations euh, confortables, même si en we fin de match, on a eu deux, deux, trois occasions. On two or three occasions. We had to come back. Uh, and uh, then we, Wendy you know, I brought Wendy in fini, because the, the match was over. Ça, c est, c est, you know, it, it happened. De, de poker, it was a play, like a poker play, really. Des, 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 des and est, the victory of the Colombia team is well Thank deserved. You, Mr. Bergero, and good luck for your third match. Merci. Thank you. Thank you, Atoll. You have a mixed zone with the players. Yes.
Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, thank you all for being here. We're now going to, start, going to start our press conference with Team Colombia. But before we start, la, we have the player of the match, and that's Lady Andrade, right? Yeah. I say it right? Okay. So she's the player of the match. We're going to have a ceremony, and then uh, we'll start a press conference. What does we need a card? Okay, before we start, I ask everyone to turn off your cell phones so we don't have any noise during your press conference. Uh, welcome, Coach Felipe. Welcome, Lady. And welcome, Sandra. Uh, congratulations for the, the winning today. And uh, I will start with the first question. And uh, that question goes to Sandra. Uh, Sandra, can you share with us feeling after this match that you did such great savings. What are your feelings about the match that just happened? Well, it's a great joy indeed. It's very gratifying for us indeed to be part of the history, part of this great moment in which Colombia has been growing. We know how we've been growing and the level and how much we've trained and how much we've made our effort to gain this uh, uh, match. And that's the result of all that we've done. Okay, now we go to our next question. Right there, please. Oh, my check. Okay. Antes que nada, muchísimas felicidades. I am so, so happy. A very well deserved 2 nil. Colombia has demonstrated to be an excellent competitor in the field. And of course, the outlook now is completely different, Prof. Uh, now you have four. You are leading the team right now, the, or the group. How do you feel? Uh, Sandra, you had a great uh, game. And uh, in spite of what uh, the no small injury that you had, can you tell me what you feel bueno, now? Creo que well, es un I think that this uh, team que tiene mucha is a team that is very ambitious, de, de uh, very much willing to uh, have a victory. And all the technical staff has said mucho. that we've cried y, a lot. Y and and the time has come now to laugh. We are with our foot Sabemos on ground, and we know what's coming no next. We didn't want here to come just to participate. Eh, we want to improve our participation uh, compared to previously. And this team has understood this. We knew that uh, we had to play intelligently with France, and uh, oh, I said it in the press conference before, and that is what we've done. These ladies are fighters, are warriors, really, and it makes me very happy indeed, and I would like to congratulate Sandra Sepulveda, our goalkeeper. And who, for an injury, uh, didn't play in the first match. And I'm very happy to have her back in this way, being so important vis a vis a power of the world. And Lady, she's an ex excellent player indeed. And life has been tough for her. And she has a great compensation now to score a goal vis a vis a power and being the best player, and, and all the team really deserves, and blessings to everybody. Well, I feel that we've worked hard to achieve this. In the previous World Cup, uh, we didn't do so well. I feel that uh, people think that Colombia is the team that comes to compete, and that's it. And uh, we have a different mindset now. We worked very hard to achieve this, and we have our goals very clear. And I think that that has made us make progress. We've been working in many weaknesses that we had in the offensive side, and we've demonstrated that it's good. The training has been 
uh, very fruitful. We are very uh, together as a group, and it will be very difficult to, for us to be defeated. And with the help of God, we've got four points. And uh, we've made history twice and uh, broken the paradigms that people had that we were not going to be able to achieve this. And we will continue being a surprise, I'm sure. The game that we are playing right now, um, we owe it to uh, Prof. Nelson Bovadilla and together with Prof. Felipe Taborda. They've taken the task of uh, considering the mistakes and uh, work on them and to see how other teams play and how Colombia should play. I think that uh, uh, this has been very important for us indeed. And, uh, we are giving back with a victory all the efforts that have been ma uh, made and the opportunity that for the first time uh, be in football, in women's football. I would like to take advantage to thank him because uh, he has given a great hand to us and made of us individuals and sports women of high performance, specialized football players, as he says. So I think that uh, he deserves indeed uh, recognition for this. Uh, next question. You have a tie and a win here in Moncton. You seem to be very comfortable here. Do you wish in the future you would play more games in Moncton? Well, I think that this team feels uh, very comfortable, and if it's in Moncton or in Montreal or in Vancouver, wherever, or in Winnipeg, uh, anywhere, I think that the team is very strengthened and will give all. And we're very grateful indeed with the city, the city of Moncton, that has provided us the opportunity to have today four points. Next question. Lady, you played against the U.S. in the other World Cup. Can you tell us whether that experience with another team of a very high level helped you in this one with France? In the previous uh, uh, World Cup, I didn't have the chance to play uh, with the U.S. because I was injured. It was in the Olympic Games that I played uh, with the U.S. Yeah, against the U.S. Well. Since you are one of the players with, with most experience in the team, can you talk about how that this has helped you or inspired others and be so calm to take the chances and use them properly? I feel that uh, of those bad things that we have experienced, we have learned indeed. That has made us mature. We are now players. Uh, who are older, and uh, we have matured. As Sandra was saying, uh, sometimes we are so much enthusiastic, but we were not able to control that. But we have matured and changed in some aspects, and that's why we are in that shape for this tournament. And uh, sometimes we were corrected, uh, because we were not treated uh, as we liked, but that made us mature. And in facing uh, major teams, uh, uh, sometimes they were uh, under control, but now we impose the game. We are under control. And the teams, um, we make them play as we want. We have evolved in our mindset, thinking uh, big, really, and that was what has changed on us. Next question, please. Congratulations for the victory. Prof, no matter what happens uh, between uh, the England and Mexico in the last uh, round, uh, you will have more points. Uh, what will happen with the strategy? And, uh, lady, 
Uh, can you talk about uh, the uh, dribble that you have, so characteristic of yours? Uh, which is like uh, football five. Uh, who are you inspiring from? Well, today we have four, four points. And that gives us the opportunity to be leaders of this group. And we are going to face England and defend our first place in this group. And I think that it will be a very beautiful game indeed, filled with joy and happiness. Uh, my inspiration is Ronaldinho. I like the way he plays. It's like uh, doing figures, dribbling. It, he has been my inspiration. And I step on the ball because uh, since I was five years old, I've uh, played uh, football. And that has made me um, dominate that technique. Uh, seven, uh, so I had uh, improved that and perfected it, and that's how I play. I would like to know what this win, this historic win, means for... What does, I would like to know what does this historic uh, win means for the football, uh, women's football program in Colombia? I think that this victory will continue and will help women's soccer in our country continue to grow and evolve. And in the end, these uh, fighters, these warriors that we have, we've told them that they have to uh, leave our name, the name of Colombia, very high, and they've done so. They have managed to uh, get what Colombia has got, and this is a compensation for what these women are achieving and contributing uh, to soccer. Women's soccer in our country has lots of good things and very positive things and now with the motivation of all these players uh, this will continue growing and will be an inspiration for others in this sport well we train and we uh, make efforts uh, on a personal basis on a, on, on a daily basis and uh, expecting that things will improve in our country in terms of women's soccer. We hope that uh, the evolution will be significant in terms of support that we may get in our country. We hope that the Federation will support us. We have had an unconditional support, but we hope that it will continue to to do so and say uh, they um, deserve a cup, they deserve a league. And we hope that uh, this will be significant and valued by, by the Federation and by everybody. Let's go to our last question. Apart from the level football level that we saw in the field, what was the role of the attitude with which the 11 players came to the field that we saw from the very beginning till the very end? I think that they've matured a great deal. They've evolved dramatically. Yesterday, we had the chance to uh, talk with them and tell them that uh, we could do an intelligent game and achieve good things for sure if we did so. And Nelson met with them as well and gave all the indications. And uh, he has contributed a great deal. Uh, he is very well experienced in soccer, and he analyzes all the games and the videos, and he's the one in charge uh, that we have to watch the games, and he takes his time, reviews, gives indications, and explains our players all the uh, details. Uh, 
necessary. And I think that today we're seeing the results of all that work, of all those people who have joined their efforts and we've become a great family in the technical staff among the players, in the federation. And uh, all these good results are achieved as a family and in unity, and this has been demonstrated by the team. Okay, so we are now done with our press conference. Thank you all for being here. Thank you, Coach Felipe, Gracias. Lady, and Sandra. And once again, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Gracias.